Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Outlaws of the Old West on the Radio Man 03. It's awesome to have you along. Here we are. Outlaws. Hitting cross country. Back down to 1114 to see if we can't find that, uh, that prospector. And gathering up a little resources on the way. I thought I'd take a cart this time just for the fun of it to see exactly what the difference is between this and the other way. And uh, you, you can't not stop and kill the bands and stuff sometimes you just have to deal with them because they're there and you just don't want them you know coming up on you so if we keep going this way right here can we get through this yeah we can um we're gonna wind up right where we need to be oh there's joker remember joker from uh last time it looks like him right there he didn't run it's almost like sometimes the animals don't notice you on the wagon if you've got the wagon with you Hope everyone's doing great. I'm doing quite well. My new guy is working out pretty good at work. It's It's been nice. He's got it figured out. Yeah, look at that. See, the sheep should run from us. Can we, can we lasso it? I don't think we can from the back of a horse. No, I don't think we can. Okay, it took off right away as soon as I got off the horse. Very interesting. Okay, so I don't think they really see the wagon as being human. Strange. Uh, I'm going to pick up some of the stuff along the way. I think I am going to stop for the sulfur and everything because I've been going through more rounds lately because I am going ahead and fighting with uh, the bands and stuff like that that I run into. So I figure, like, this is what we should do. Uh, and I like to get off the horse to mine the stuff up. It gives me a chance to stop and kind of look around and, and uh, just kind of enjoy the uh, the area. It's not about, for me, getting done fast. It's a lot of work, guaranteed, but I'm having a good time just being actually in the world. It doesn't have to be fast. I know some of you want to see me mine a node from the back of the horse. There's a big old steer. Am I actually hitting it? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it to me. I'm probably too close or something. We could try again. Hello, gold dragon. It is a Tuesday afternoon, so I am streaming on Twitch TV. Oh, I missed a piece. What the heck? How'd I miss that piece? <laughs> Uh, so I've grabbed up some I've grabbed up some sulfur. I've grabbed up some salt. I've not grabbed any coal yet. Uh, one thing I did notice is that you cannot have the horse. It doesn't seem like the horse will follow me uh, when it's attached to a cart. I'm also grabbing up a little bit of this stuff here too. You always need this for something, fiber and you know the the plants. You need it for something. So I've grabbed up a few of these. I think we're doing okay with that. Let me grab this coal too. Might as well. It's just one little node sitting here. We'll have a little bit of coal on us too. I've killed four bandits and one TNT bandit. Making my way back to 1114 to see if we can't run into the guy, the prospector. That's the goal here. Uh, first thing in the episode. And, yeah, we're almost on track. We need to turn a little bit more to the southeast. But we're there. Uh, this is, uh, I've got um, Bonita with us, and her stamina does go down a little faster. It looks like it never all comes all the way up, either, when she's pulling the cart. So there's a, there's a reduction in how far she can go, for sure, which would make total sense. Green Gem, hello. Good night. Zero AM. <laughs> it is three o'clock in the afternoon for me right now. Three o'clock. I know. It's a it's a rough time to try to get some of you to be able to be able to watch. Maybe when winter rolls around and we've got less going on, you know, work's all figured out and stuff like that. Maybe we can do some on the weekends or something too. Oh, she's out of stamina. She's exhausted. So we go down to walk mode, which is also quite a bit slower, too. You definitely get a good look at the world. Uh, in case you didn't notice, we are sporting a new hat, indeed. And a new shirt as well. Inventory, let's see here. 
What do we got on? We have the uh, the bib shirt mm -hmm. and the cattleman hat. Thought we'd change it up again just to see what uh, some of the different clothes look like. This one's pretty cool. It's kind of a lightish green color. But I like the hat. I do like the hat. Oh, what do we got over here? Hmm. Bonita, forward, please. I missed him. I think I showed you guys that I got the scoped rifle now. There he is. Let's get away from Bonita. Wait a minute. Or orbital mode. Look at my legs. <laughs> okay. Oh my goodness. That looked pretty weird. I was all excited about the kill. What we got here? This is the bank bang guy. All right, I got the bank bag. I got the bank bag this time. Are you proud of me? You should be. Uh, something I noticed about this thing is I can't access just the wagon. How do you do that? I have to detach the horse. Now, that, that detached her. She's, she's detached right now. And now it says I have to uh, attach her again in order to get... And then i got to back out of this again in order to do this. It seems kind of weird to me that I've got to do that. Uh, we should probably keep moving. I want to get to 11.14 before it's dark. Oh, man. Okay, we're right next to it right over here. We just need to keep going this way. This way. But need to have a nice little rest. I'm not very good with the sniper rifle yet. As you know, I have... Uh, I'm... I'm load my gun challenged so I shoot it and then I expect another round to be in it without me having to load it again. <laughs> cookie cookie, hello. Place, hello. Thank you for coming by you guys. We'll do it again on Thursday. This new guy was talking about how I've got this uh, new guy at work that's going to be my news editor for the afternoons and stuff and he's working out really good. Smart guy. Picking up real nice and fast so that's a good thing. So life should get kind of back to normal within, by the end of next week. Where I'll have a little more time to do this. Right now I don't, because I've got to make the long drive every day. Got to train that boy in right. <laughs> okay, I think I see the lake right over here. I believe that's the lake right over there. I won't stop for anything else. I'll just go. I, I know I said I wouldn't stop, but here I am stopping. We gotta go easy on Bonita's stamina. You know, I'm gonna, I'm gonna assume that she's probably using more water too. But I thought it'd be kind of cool if this time we were going back down to the desert to uh, stockpile stuff. We'll see how long it takes to fill the cart up with everything we need. I've got a, a bunch of stuff in there right now already. Okay, she's gonna be exhausted. We're gonna have to. Oh, oh. Wow, there's a lot of material right in here. Look at this. There's even stone nodes right here. There's a stone node. There's another one. There's coal. There's salt. There's iron. Ooh, this is uh, this is a fruitful little spot here. Look at all this stuff right here. Look at all the iron over here in the distance. This place is a mega jackpot too of stuff. Oh, I can see why people are intrigued to live by the pond. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this place is loaded. Dang, look at all that stuff out here. That's a lot of material. 1114, huh? Okay. I see. Oh, I'm hungry. I'm eating cooked meat now. Well, I was. Now it's gone. <laughs> okay, you guys tell me to hang out up here at the uh, inlet of 1114. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to detach Benita and we're going to ride around and see if he does pop up. Uh, you said it's like clockwork. I believe clockwork was what it was. It said. Detach our horse. There we go. And... Benita, how is your water anyways? You've been, uh... It's fine. It's just fine. What I've said is the inlet to the mouth of the lake. 
this is the lake, I presume. And here is the inlet, and he's supposed to be around here like clockwork. I'm here at 2.10 p.m. It's not as early as I wanted to get here, but I'm here. Oh, there he is. There he is. Look at him. There he is. Yeehaw. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me, gentlemen, sir. Look at you. Look at you. That is quite a character. Could you stack it any higher? What you got there? Hmm? His eyes are so yellow. Yep. You got some stuff for me, huh? Okay, so what's this premium large pickaxe? Premium two-handed pickaxe for harvesting boulders. Buy it for 600 bucks. Ooh, it's on, is it on sale for $300? A gold mine. Mine shaft. Buy $2,000. I'm going to buy the mine shaft. This is, this is to enter a mine. I'm buying. Should I buy that? What do you think? Should I buy the mine or should I buy the pickaxe? I can't buy both. I think I should get the mine since I'm here and it's here. I can get it, right? It's, it's buy $2,000. This one's 3000 I can't get the gold mine, which is fine. But the two, this one here, I did it. I bought it. Oh, I can't get the premium pickaxe, though. <clears throat> I think the mine's a better choice, though. What do you think? In the long run, I'm going to be able to get more resources closer to home. You, sir, are quite the character. Look at that. Look at that pack. He's got himself a rifle. He's got arrows sticking out of him. That's what he's got. He's got some arrows sticking out of him. What's in the little jar on top of his head, do you think? Maybe some kind of moonshine or something? He's a prospector, but he's got nothing in his belt. He needs uh he needs a oh he's got something over here. He's got like a little axe or something. He's got a little hatchet right here. Cooking pan. Oh, there's his pipe. Is that his pipe? Smoking pipe or something to uh he's got a spoon on there. Yeah, I like him. He's very cool. Alright, thanks guys. That's perfect. We got him. We got the mine. I'm I'm afraid to look over at chat and say, what? You're over you're over encumbered. Have you lost your mind? Let's go back to the wagon. That was pretty cool. He's awesome. It's an awesome little dude. I don't think I actually checked out the, the cook as well. I should have done that. We'll find him again. He's he's up by us along that edge, and I go down there a lot. This is an absolute gold mine of stuff right through here. Last time we came up here, it was getting dark, and I think we came in from over here this way, so we didn't quite see it. Uh, let's get you close to the cart. There we go, and let's put that in here, that there, that, and that. All right. The mine shaft. We'll have to see. I was thinking about putting the mine shaft actually down here in the desert. What do you guys think? It would be, got, it'd be It's kind of fun to, I think, travel across the map and uh, go from one spot to another. It keeps you from getting stagnant and being at home all the time and get stuck doing the same thing over and over again. We got ourselves uh, some riffraff over here. And now that we know where he is, we can we can always go after him again once we get the money. <coughs> oh, he's thirsty. Hold on. Flint's thirsty, everybody. Woohoo! Smoked him! Should have got him with two shots or just the one on the head, but I failed. And he reloaded. Ladies and gentlemen, Flint Westwood just reloaded his gun. It's unbelievable. Seventeen dollars. We're almost to that six hundred we need for the pickaxe. Uh, so I'm sure you guys know. I'm sure you've heard. The pickaxe probably gives you is it more resource? I would hope, or is it just it uh, picks faster? Um, oops. 
Uh, the cook. I can't give you a specific location for where the cook is. The cook is... I've spent a few times going up and down this area right here. I want to say he's in somewhere right in here. And I've bumped into him a few t a couple of times going back and forth, getting the iron and everything along here. I wanted to open the map, and that's where I was running into him. I would probably say, you know, I don't know. It's, it's somewhere in that area is where I've seen the cook. Sorry, Cookie. I had to buy something. <laughs> I don't want to save the money. I, I'm kind of a bum because I wanted to make... Um, well, we'll get the mine up and running and we'll, we'll, we'll go through it. I've never done it before. I've never seen the... Whoa, what the heck? That's a, quite a deer. <laughs> I've not seen uh, a Tier 2 mine before on the inside, so it'll be interesting. I understand it's a lot busier than the Tier 1 is. So I thought it'd be kind of cool. Some action. Some crazy minor action. Uh, we're not too far from being back to the mining operation. I suppose what I could do is just, yeah, I'm just going to head south now. Uh, to get across, the, the river was kind of cool. You could swim with the cart attached to the horse, and then they just pull it out of the river. It's like they're both swimming, I guess. But I cannot get her to follow me while she's attached to the cart. I think I said that already. What do we got over here? Oh, out of stamina. All we can do is trot now. It's fine, maybe I'm buying this game, but I will wait a little longer. Um, yeah. As I say, I like it for what it is right now. It uh, kind of gives me the ability to play a game like this. Be a cowboy, so I like that. It's good for me. And we're direct, we are directly south of this location right here, so we need to turn and get going this way. It looks pretty cool with the cart, huh? Have you guys ever done this? Gone cross country and just pulled a cart to see what it was like? It's pretty cool. And then we're gonna load it up with all our goods from down there. We're gonna bring it back up here, and we are gonna get the barn put up. I did. Uh, put up more of the front wall of the barn so we could see it uh, But of course we're not there, so I can't see it right now. I'm gonna move a little bit further so that Barry doesn't get any ideas There we go This is a nice little spot right down here Look at all these trees, huh? This is pretty sweet. I like this. I Like all the trees very forested area. I'm hoping that a lot more of the bugs get worked out of it, and I hope it's sooner than later. How about that? You think that's pretty fair? That's just it. I think this game has a really a big potential. It really does. If you like to build and you like to be like this and doing this kind of thing, I think it could have a lot of potential. That's what I think, anyways. That's that's my humble opinion, my IMHO. Please. <laughs> oh, I think maybe right here. Come on. You got it. There you go. Good job. Good job. Good job. Oh, that would be so difficult. Oh, she's working so hard. There we go. Up and over. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, how's our map? What are we doing? Um, yes, this is great. We're going just the right direction. It's going to take a little while to get there. But we're only 15 minutes in, so we're doing pretty good. If we keep focused on just trying to get there, that would be great. I'm curious to really get into the desert and do some uh, serious mining in there and just give it a really good look. I'm, I'm curious. I'm going to follow the border. I want to open the desert up and see what's what's down in there. It's a pretty cool area. I love the way it looks from over here, too. It looks really neat. It does not look very hospitable, but we got to go right over in there. We got to that's that's actually quite a ways away. <laughs> and you guys are going for the ride. Cuz I can't just break away. Oh. Stamina's gone again. Vultures, stagecoaches. You know what? Um, oh, 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 oh. Here we go. Here we go. Hold on. 
Uh, I made the covered wagon, but I could not get it to move with the horse. Now, the only thing I could think of was maybe I've got to make that whip to crack a whip over the horse. That just didn't make me feel too good. Call me crazy, but... I made it, but I could not get it to move uh, with her attached to it. I thought it was kind of weird. But what I liked about the, st of the uh, covered wagon is that you actually sit up in the wagon. somebody walking right there, but it's not. It's the back end of a horse. <laughs> There's somebody in a black coat. Uh, oh, we're, you know what we're going to need? We're going to need our oil lamp here. Hold on. Oh, you know what else I have? Is I've got a torch. That looks pretty cool at night. Can I not have that out? Yeah, I can. There we go. I'm not quite sure why he put that away. We're riding all night. I need to let her stamina get back up, though, again. She's, uh, she's low. Oh. You guys might not be able to see this, but I, I see him. Oh, no. Oh, he moved. He, he moved. He moved. He's not hearing those bullets going around him. He felt that one, but he was stuck. It's cheap. It's cheap. He's getting all jammed up over there. <laughs> Bam. Turn the, uh, the old torch on. was a fair distance away. Your bank robbing days are over. I'm gonna get it. Just pick up the money bag. Pick up the money bag. <laughs> Alright. Uh, back to what we were doing. Oh, fireflies! Very cool. Very cool. I love that. That is a nice little touch, for sure. Belgian draft horses. That would be cool. Uh, oh, for a second I thought the cart wasn't with me. It seemed like I was moving pretty fast there. Hmm. <laughs> He's just flipping all kinds of stuff around. Watch it. Watch it bear. So I was thinking I might stream Atlas on some days, too. That could be fun. Especially in the next couple of weeks, it's just easier to stream. I think I heard a badger. I think the game, yeah, I, I believe this game's got... It could have a lot going for it. It could. I notice people want to have quests in it and stuff like that. I've just, I guess, I've always thought that when it's a survival game, you kind of make up your own story, right? I mean, it's all about your survival. So that's kind of the story and the goal. It would be kind of cool if, like in Red Dead, if the sheriff had, um, like, posse notes that you could go capture somebody or... Well, posse, I guess a posse, yeah. Like warrants for people. It'd be kind of cool if you could, uh, bounties. It'd be cool if you could go, go out and do that. Is that something for the sheriff? Clydesdales would be fun. But I agree, some different types of horses would be nice. I'm always about horses. It'd be nice if you could um, change the color of your saddle... Or there were more saddle color options out there. That would be nice. 
Is there more saddles available with one of the uh, one of the guys, like the taxidermist or something? These are questions I ponder. I gotta tell you one thing, you certainly don't get there very fast pulling a cart. No, you don't. But there, she's out of stamina again. I know I'm not stopping for stuff, but I just feel like I need to get down there so we can continue episodes from down that area. Something new other than... This is the third time we've ridden through here, and now we're pulling a cart, so it's taking even longer. <laughs> but, it's fun to have the cart. I've always wanted to do it, and I've never done this, so here we are. I would love to have about a thousand iron bars. That's a tall order, but I think it's doable. <clears throat> I don't know how many... How long it would take us to get that together? A thousand iron bars is just a... Sounds like a tremendous amount, doesn't it? Whoa. What's up with the animals, man? That kind of stuff would be nice if they, they got that kind of stuff fixed. And the landscape so you don't get stuck anymore and the animals move right. Like the barn, um, leaving the house today, the ranch, there was the the bushes showing in the in the barn through the floor. And I know it's because it's some of these permanent ones they have in here, but they should disappear as well, I think. I have killed quite a few people today. What is that guy? What did that guy give me? I don't know if they're giving me any pistol ammo or what. I don't see any pistol ammo on me. Yeah, her stamina never does go all the way up, I don't think. Not when pulling a cart. No, I, I highly doubt you're going to have that in the game. Why am I stopping for this one? I don't know. I just felt like I had to have it. Oh, there's more of you. We gotta go over here. Uh, Quisqueria's pack could be touchy, Argonaut. That could be very touchy. Mm -hmm. I liked um, that show. Uh, what's it called? Cookie's talking about Al Swearingen. Um, uh, Blackwood. Right? I'm like drawing a blank on that Western series. We'll be there soon, kids. Don't you worry. Just have to hope she doesn't get too tired all the time. Uh oh, I'm out of water. What the heck? Some of that dry meat, that always helps a, a lack of water. Looks to me like we're gonna get there about midday tomorrow. <laughs> At least. Oh, wolves. Man, the animals seem to be dropping in kind of late lately. You know that? It's a little odd how they've 
that's like the third one we've had now. Ball right on top of us, or fourth. Have you guys ever tried the cover wagon on this one? Deadwood, thank you. God, I don't know why I couldn't think of that. We just watched the movie for that, that series. It was all right. Cooking would be a good thing in the game, if that's what you're talking about, Gold Dragon. Not need a meal. Yeah, that stamina goes down quick. I guess maybe energy is what I should be pumping on her, huh? I think that's what I've been doing, though, right? Energy? Yeah, looks like it. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, I don't know that there's too much stuff right out in this area, huh? We've not seen... I'm trying to keep an eye on resources and see where they are. Because there's a lot of different places on the map that look really nice to, to build on. <clears throat> Some of these areas, excuse me again, would be really easy to, to build quite a bit on it. Hold on. Thanks, guys. Work call. I know, and I didn't have to say a word. <laughs> it's power right there. It's just power. No, it was uh, voicemail. Oh, well, I need to be okay. Gotcha. Thank you, Gold Dragon. Thank you for keeping track of my gut. My empty gut. So you guys still playing this? You building anything? Playing the game? Oh, I don't know if you saw that green gem, but yes, the uh, energy is the stamina. I think, right? I believe it extends the stamina. She's just, um, she's not getting all of it back being attached to this wagon. At least I don't think she is. Let's see. She's getting stamina right now. Her water and food are still, like, have barely moved. It seems weird to me that their food doesn't do more. Will she regain all of it? Looks to me like she's going to. We'll see if it changes when I get on her. Okay, full stamina. Nope, I'm just not giving her enough time to, to regain it, that's all. Made a jerk. I'm forcing the horse to run when it doesn't want to run anymore. I've not had any problems on the landscape getting over here on the horse with the wagon, which is cool. They do have enough areas. I've even taken it through like these rocky areas like this just to see if, you know, it get hung up or anything like that. And so far, uh, it's been really good. And it's nice that it goes across the river too. That's a huge plus, I think. We've got to be getting close now, right? We've got to be. I don't know if she could regain her stamina either if we just hit zero and let her go. If she will regain all of it back, looks to me like it's still going up, so she's not losing any. It probably does take her longer to regain it, though, I would imagine. It hesitates here and there, it looks like. Well, maybe not. It's hard to tell. Uh, let's check our map. Whoa, weird. What, where? Whoa, 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 whoa. What am I doing? Look at this map. We are right over here. We need to start heading to the east. <laughs> right now. 
I had no idea we were this far down in here. Uh, we could probably put the torch out too. Thank you, Flint, for the light. We appreciate the extra effort to make the video look better. I don't like turning up the gamma. Selfish, isn't it? That'd be pretty if it was all white. I would do. I would. I would grab a, an all white horse. That would be kind of cool. Well, what's this up here? We got a different kind of horse coming up here. Mm, that's black and white. There's nothing special about that horse. How am I doing? Uh, yeah, we should be able to... Well, where's the waterfall at on that lake? Uh, I believe we're right over across this area right here, so we should be good. We should be good cruising right up through here. Oh boy. Does her stamina go down faster up the hill? Hmm. I don't think I'm really seeing a difference. down for repairs dragon oh my god I would, I would be I would not be pleased how long have you been without it your computer Wow, it's getting pretty desolate out here, isn't it? <laughs> These trees are getting pretty scarce. Aspen trees growing down here. I have aspen trees uh, that line my driveway. I think they're a pretty nice tree. I like them. My neighbor doesn't like them at all, but they're not his trees, so... Too bad. Uh, yeah, we should be coming up on it right around this big rock here. We'll let her get her stamina back so we can get through the river and everything okay. We'll be good to go. Ooh. I had my motherboard go out once on my old computer. I think I was out of business for just a few days of recording and stuff. They did a good job of getting the part here really fast. This new computer that I have, I actually have to ship it back in order to get it fixed. Where the other one, they sent somebody to the house, a technician local that would work on it. Which was, now that I think about it, really a nice thing. I don't think shipping a computer is ever a good idea. Oh, got bandits over there. I'm really not interested in having a gunfight with you guys, but the house is right up over there. It's going to happen. That was a little bit better. <laughs> I didn't miss as many times. I got two of them from quite a ways away. Watch it, rabbit. That's my kill. Nice. Give me the loot, pal. There we go. Bandits down here in the desert. Love it. Perfect. Gotta have them. Bandits make it worthwhile. I like the fact that they're all over the place and it's not just any one particular area. There we go. Uh, 
Yes, if I'm remember right, the waterfall should be over this way and then just down this hill. Oop, that stream was looking a little laggy there. I don't have the skill set to be taking computers apart and putting them back together again. That's just... Oh! Look at here! Look at here! Let's, let's, let's get over here. He's having a difficult time. Here's that, uh... Thief. Hello, sir! I want my money back. <laughs> um, where are we at? Now, this is the second location we found him in. Before, we were uh, way up in here somewhere where we found him before. He just kind of rolled up on us. But yeah, he doesn't have anything. You're dirty. Use this to clean up. What does it matter if I'm dirty? There he is, though. Snake oil salesman. Yep, knock that dirt off your feet. And that's his driver right there. There you go. That's the second time we've bumped into him now. We just kind of, whoop, there he is. Uh, okay, so how do I get down and across this to get to where I need to be? No. I need to get out in third person again. No, 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 just take it easy. <laughs> I didn't notice that before, but the leg comes down from his uh, his stand that he's on. It's got a little piece of stone on it, so it kind of tries to blend in with uh, the world around it. There's the house. I see it right over there. There it is, the Flint Wood Mining Operation in the desert. Deep into the desert. I like having something down here. This is This is fun. I enjoy this ride back and forth. It's cool. We got a pretty good supply of trees and stuff over here. Not too shabby, uh, but not too far away right over there, too. We've got some more if we need it. Uh, but I am going to have to cross this here lake. Bonita, have you got it in you? I think I better let her stamina get all the way up because she's going to have to ride with this cart all the way across. And I do believe they use stamina. So let's let her fill up a little bit before we uh, force her into something like this. Jason, hello. Max, sorry I didn't see you up there. It's good to see you. How are we doing? I think we got enough. Nah, let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. And, uh, oh, you know what we could do? While she's loading up with that, let's go ahead and go down here and fill up the canteen and take a little drink. There we go. Eat some of that delicious charred meat. Mmm. Oh, let's do it. Come on, Bonita. Drag that thing through the dang lake. <laughs> uh, be kind of cool if they had, um, you know, like low water areas that kind of rippled and stuff. That would be kind of cool. Oh, there's some ducks. That would be pretty cool. Her stamina goes down, but not very fast when she's pulling a cart through the water. Oop, 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 oop. Got a little, got a little a bit of a you-know-what thing going on there. I believe up this way we should be able to uh, get there. God, we're almost back. I didn't think it was going to go that fast. We actually... Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Gang, gang. <laughs> what is up with gangs today? Holy cow, I keep running into a bunch of these guys. Yeah, let's make sure it's loaded, because you know me. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I missed. Oh, my phone's going off. I got this guy shooting at me. Sorry about 
Oh, guys. I push pause, but you can't pause. Die, guy. Jeez. Oh, bars. Okay, good. My phone was just out of reach. There's no way I was going to reach for it. I couldn't do anything about it. It's being shot up. My life was in danger. I, my health got down a little ways. <laughs> you guys meant some business. All right, let's uh, let's continue on. Oh, I know meant something I meant to talk about with the game is that I have had where the tools and the weapons are not loading into my hand properly and they look weird. They're like underneath my hand. But if I go to my inventory and back out, it seems to fix the problem. Look out, little fox. Whoops. Sounded angry. Come on. You can do it. Up you go. Ooh, that's a steep one. We're here, though. That is the way up. Hey. Did I do this wrong? There's the house. Yeah, I see ya. I see ya. Miserable buffalo. He's not happy either. There we go. So I wonder if that area, remember we killed that horse that was stuck in the rocks? I wonder if that area just isn't uh, a spawn point for horses. And it just happened to spawn the wrong way. So are we kicking up dust with this thing? We sure are. Look at that. So I have the cart here. We can bring our goods back, get them processed, put them in the cart, and take the cart back home. Perfect idea. It's a perfect plan. There we go. Let's throw all that stuff in there as well. Uh, let's grab this stuff up here, though. We want that for cooking. We need that for cooking. Auto stack and sort. Uh, we needed... Let's grab all of this stuff as well. This is stuff we definitely want to keep here. Uh, I guess we could crush that up. And crush that up. I can't reach that because it's behind the... Uh... Can I not get to that because of that? Oh my gosh. I can't click on anything behind this right here. <laughs> what is that all about? That's weird. Um, okay. Yeah, I can't click on any of that stuff right there. Are you still attached? No. There we go. Let's get her a drink of water. Give her some food. She's all fixed up. Go into here. Let's go ahead and... Jeez, I guess we'll just split it. And we're going to make it do... We'll just have it craft all. Since I'm not in a hurry for it, it can do all of them. We're going to have to go out and get more stuff anyways. Uh, I had canvas. Tell me I didn't leave the canvas back there. No, it's inside. It's inside what you might call it, huh? Um. Six more over here. Now, can I search this cart without her next to it? Oh, there we go. Okay, beautiful. Whew. Okay, much better. And we've got that. Oh, don't tell me I didn't... I don't think I did. Yeah, I did not grab the uh, canvas. I had canvas. I know I did. 
Threw some shutters and some lanterns in here. I don't know if I had the lanterns in or the shutters. I, I'm pretty sure I had the shutters in. And I've not done anything off the back here yet. I would uh, still like to do something like that. There we go. And you can open back up. And what was I doing? I'm going to make some canvas, huh? What do I need for the tent? Rope 10, 5 wood. Rope 10 and 5 wood. And do I have any rope here? No, I don't. So. Here we go. Here's our tent. <laughs> All right, very nice. Wanted that one for sure. Uh, we're almost there, guys. We'll have our tent. Very good, very good. I should get the rest of this iron going too. Well, let's do that right now while we're waiting for that to cook up. Every little bit truly does help in this game. All right, there's our tent. Awesome. Let's uh, let's go get that set up. Oh, I've got another hundred right here too. Oh, okay. Let's. Uh, we're all about the iron, are we not? I think what I do is I I mine some of that stuff up, and I decided not to cook it up just yet. Oh, we'll throw that in there too. Auto stack and sort. Thank you very much. Who doesn't want to sleep on some nice cold ground? But this is a spawn point that we can use, so this would be kind of cool. Oh, I got rid of the grass. I was kind of hoping to be there. Set spawn. Okay, now I got to make sure I don't, uh, you know, uh, not reset my spawn when I get back. Move. So if I move, I'm hoping it probably folds back up, huh? And I can pick it back up again. Okay, that's pretty cool. I like that. That's very nice. I like that a lot. Okay. I was kind of hoping those pieces of grass would stay there. Yeah, a little camp out here. I think that's perfect. Perfect. And didn't I just pick up some wood? There we go. Oh, I've got 85 in there. Oh, there's mine. Okay. My inventory wasn't scrolled all the way up. That's why I could not see the canvas, is what I was trying to say all that time. And we've got something else to crush. It's not a lot, but it's better than nothing. All right. Uh, we did good. We did good. We're back. Which direction are we going to go when it comes time to do this? Let's take a look at the map again. I think what I would like to do is continue to go all the way down to the bottom and kind of map this out and see how far it goes. You can see I don't really have anything uh, opened up over here. So maybe this, maybe it just ends right here. Maybe it does. I don't know. But uh, I would like to go back down this way and kind of just snake through here and see if we can do that. I know there's some really deep canyons. We found them last time. I thought it was pretty cool. Uh, how they looked. So we'll go back down in there and do that again for sure. So this is good, right? We got the mine. Oh, where could we put the mine? Ooh. Let's see what it looks like. Oh, it's the... What? Is this another tier one mine? That's it? Because that's going to take a donkey, right? What did I buy? It's just a mine shaft. I wonder... What do you think? It looks to me like it's just a... It's a single.
Well, maybe not. Maybe this is different. It looks a little different. I'm thinking about setting it right here. Literally right here. There is a rock underneath that point. I'm trying to see if there's a spot to put it where it would sit. I'll be able to see it. No, nah, it's the same as the other one, huh? It's the same as the other one. Now that I've placed it, now I got the whole platform showing, so it's it's different. I'm a little disappointed. Is this is not the tier two mine? Is that what the gold mine is now? Is that what they're calling that one? Whatever. I'll put one of these down here too. Where am I going to go with it? Do that right there. Got the platform already attached to it. Yeah. Kind of a bummer. It's no different than the other one. Well, I guess what this means is if we come down here, it's just to do that we go through that, clear it out, take what we can from it, and then we continue just mining the entire area until we, you know figure out exactly where the most chunks of ores are. I'm a little disappointed though that I spent $2,000 and got a tier 1 mine. It seems kind of weird. Hmm. The sun went down all of a sudden. I think I'm going to wrap up the episode right there. Tell me what you guys think of that. It's kind of crazy, but yeah, i got to cut it uh, a little bit short today on the stream, but thank you everybody for, for coming in. I appreciate you hanging out with me this afternoon. We got a little bit of something. We got the wagon all the way down here. We do have a mine. We met the guy. We found the snake oil salesman. We pitched our tent and saved our spawn point. We got a killer dust devil going on right now. Uh, so yeah, it's been good. All right, guys. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, hit the like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Man 3 Have an awesome, fantastic, and a superb day. And I look forward to talking to you again next time.